Welcome to the Muskegon Channel. It's Andy O'Reilly and I am down at the Muskegon Farmer's Market today. You know the face next to me. She's a frequent flyer. <laughs> Ann Mish from the city of Muskegon is here. It is uh, Danielle Madaco right there in the middle with the cool sunglasses. And Laura, i got to get cool too. i got to put my shade <laughs> on too. Bright sunny day down here and uh, Miss Johnson down on the end with the Muske or the Women's Division Chamber of Commerce. Welcome everybody. Nice Thank to you. see you Thank all. You. Speak up nice and loud. Yeah. We're all excited. We are excited. It's uh, Wednesday night. That's Let's right. Start off. Food trucks. Food trucks. People are nuts about these they food trucks. They are loving it, as you know. Yeah. Yes, yes. How many are we expecting this Wednesday? Uh, we have, I believe, 22. Really? Yes. And it's going to be a little bit of everything. It is, it is. It's going to be, yeah, we have all kinds of stuff there. Like? Well, I'm excited because we have only, um, only cannoli coming. Yeah. yeah, that's the first time for that one. Um, yeah, you're excited too now. See, I see that. <laughs> uh, um, Sam's Mediterranean is going to be there, Very you know. Nice. And then we've got the, uh, the firewood pizza. Um, nice. which is a fun one too and then we have uh, fatty lumpkins and we've got um, just classics and we've got uh, bone ends bone ends is a really big one too and of course oh she's cheating she's I looking i'm looking is that what you know but we have okay so we have uncle bill's tacos yeah. everybody's got to have tacos right we also have frank's tacos too they're really really good um almond sensations do you like those mm -hmm. i love the almonds look at me oh my gosh <laughs> <laughs> they're good we have a beshi you know he um he was here the last time he was huge he had he, he had all kinds of great stuff there smoking on the lake shore very cool have you had that mm -hmm. it was really good you gotta check that out that silver time. star um cafe that's um, and then of course we have summer pops. Okay. You know, um, yeah. they have these popsicles, but they're really unique. They're made here at Kitchen 242. Right. Kitchen really awesome stuff. So um, yodels, uh, frozen yogurt, yeah. fantastic. They sold out last time. Nice. Completely sold out. So uh, Aloha um, shaved ice. Uh, we have um, A and E barbecue. Nice. Yeah, that's awesome too. Nobody's so. gonna go away hungry. No, everybody is gonna. Have really now, let's get down to the Women's Division Chamber of Commerce here. They have this downtown dancing thing that's been going on since 2014. And one was on a Wednesday night, one was on a Thursday night, and then some phone calls happened and all yeah. these things got going on. Start off by telling me a little bit about the Women's Division Chamber of Commerce down there. and what, Tell me what you guys are all about. Well, the Women's Division, we have approximately 240 members right now, volunteers. Um, and they, a lot of them are on a lot of other committees, boards, sure. things like that. And, that's Muskegon for you. Right. Find and, a board and you're going to find five of them. Right, that's the way it works. And, <laughs> and our mission is, um, part of it is just to give back and do some things, positive things in the Muskegon area. Sure. Things like that. So. Yeah. So, Danielle, tell me a little bit about this downtown band. It was your idea, of course. Oh, yes. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> um, it was actually started in 2014, yeah. like you said. And it started out just a few food trucks, and then they would put down a little dance floor and have some music, live music. Um, this year, they were off by like a day or so, so we decided, actually it was Lori's brilliant idea. See? Um, See? She knows. She, yeah. A little smile comes out exactly. down there, but she knows, yeah. Exactly. It was a really great idea. <laughs> so she um, got with the city of Muskegon and talked about merging these two awesome events, and so far they seem to be going very well. It's a good partnership idea. Yeah. Absolutely. So, so, and that's what these things are yes. all about. They yes. build, they grow, you find these partnerships as things go right. on, you find new ways to make things happen and, 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 and get things to grow. When, when Downtown Dancing first got underway, did you, did you have the reception you expected, or was it better or, or worse? Previously? Yeah. Um, I think is what, I wasn't involved with it then, we are new co-chairs this year. Sure. So I believe, you know, it was going great, but now it's just bigger, and we've been more food trucks, you know, partnering with the city, there's more food trucks now. Um, we've got, you know, great bands, mm -hmm. great sponsors for the bands. Yeah. You know, the yes. community is really backing us on that. It's a lot been of awesome. Sponsors. Yeah. It's really oh. just family friendly fun. That's another big thing about this. You know, a lot of these bands, I, I know Yard Sale Underwear was down here last yes. week. Yeah. This week, I'm, if I'm not mistaken, it's the Soul Surfers yes, that is. are coming up. West Side Soul Surfers. And a lot of times, is you know, you go out and see these guys in clubs and yep. you go out and see them in places like that. Well, the younger people can't get in. And that's a great thing about downtown dancing is right. it's right here at this farmer's market. It's all ages. Yep. Anybody can come. The shows are clean. They're fun. They're a good experience yep. for everybody. And yep. it gives the kids a chance to get out and really be a part of what's going on right. as well. 
so much fun. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's a great thing. What's it going to cost me to get in this? Like $20 a ticket? Like a dollar a ticket. <laughs> what? Yeah. So it's free to get in. Absolutely <laughs> yeah. free. So you, um, to pay well, for I knew your it was food, free. I was just, I was, you know. <laughs> <laughs> to, but to pay for your food, you buy tickets. Yeah. And then you just go to the vendors and you pay that. And that's how we actually collect the funds. And um, so we, and then I wanted to mention too that this Wednesday, we're also going to have the big red football players there who are going to help and um, come and help us remove trash. Nice. Um, and then in exchange, they're going to be selling, you know, they have those little discount cards. That's yeah. how they raise money. Sure. So they're going to be walking around selling those. And then we're going to have a couple of tip jars out that people can give to the big reds football um, team or the most winning um, um, games in history. That's yeah. what they have got going on there. So we're really excited to um, have them involved. But I did want to point out that um, we can't do all of this without our sponsors, no. which are fantastic. So we have um, Uganski's Roll Off uh, Services and Ganyan Well Drilling, Van Dyke Mortgage, Nexus Realty, Gems on the Lakeshore, and Bob and Kay Bowen um, that are sponsoring this time for Westside Soul Surfers. So we're just really super excited. And I would imagine the women's division has got a couple of people backing them on some of this stuff as well. Who, who helps you pull all this off? Is well, that those, the list that's right there? what Lori, yeah. Oh, Lori, there you go. Aunt, so Aunt, that's what, <laughs> Lori was the one who actually got Aunt. that. So that was fantastic. <laughs> so she got all the music, oh, the women's division did get all the music paid for us uh, for this year. And, and you know, it was exciting when we first started um, talking, Lori and I did. Uh, we found out that we were already booking two of the three bands, the same bands. Nice. And that's when it all came together, and they were going to be a day apart. And we were like, well, huh, mm -hmm. you know, what should we do about yeah. this? So we're just really excited because they've been fantastic. They're out there selling the tickets and uh, just really promoting. And and in the meantime, it like brings more exposure to the, the dancing part sure. and, and um, their organization. So it's just been a great partnership. It is great. Anybody's interested in joining this Women's Division Chamber of Commerce, tell, me how, how, tell us how to go about that. We do have a website okay. that they can go to, or they can um, feel free, any of our members, they can be invited to one of our lunches that we have, monthly meetings, okay. and which are held at the Country Club. Generally. Ooh, swanky. So, that's nice. Very so nice. So we have it there. Um, <laughs> but anyone's welcome to, yeah. to come. Very cool. So just check with one of us, and we can give you the information. Just like that. No go. secret ceremony you have to go through? Or? Uh, no, we won't tell that. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a secret. It's downtown dancing Wednesday night with the Women's Division Chamber of Commerce and of course the food truck rally down here at the Farmer's Market. It's a great time. It's a great community event. Make sure you're a part of it. All the details will be linked right up here on the Muskegon Channel. Thank you everybody for taking Thank a couple you. of minutes Thank today. You. Thank you. Wish you the very best on Wednesday night. We hope to see you down here.